What's good, you lot? Welcome to Book Club. I thought we'd start off with a great comment from one of you. It is Super Sparkly Sunset, who's been in touch to say, Jacqueline Wilson is my favorite author, and I've been reading her books since I was four or five. Well, what a coincidence, because Jacqueline Wilson is our amazing author that we're looking at this week. Yes, she's a legend, and we've got even more of your comments about her, like Purple Hamster Reader, who says, I really like the illustrated mum. I think it's really cool, full of drama, and I love it. I also really like the story of Tracy Beaker. It's one of my favorite books of all time. Well, of course it is. Jackie Wilson is honestly a legend. She's written so many books. And here is Kate, who's been in touch with her review on Diamond. I'm Diamond, from Jacqueline Wilson's book of the same name. Je Ellen Jane Potts is the fifth born child in her family, a great disappointment to her parents who wanted a strong, healthy son. Her father ends up selling her for only five guineas. However, she transforms into Diamond, the acrobatic child wonder and star of the circus. When she's maltreated there, she dreams of escaping. Read on to find what, out what happens. Hey, that's how you sell a story. You're incredible. Uh, now, let's go on to the main thing, though. Let's hear from the author herself, Jacqueline Wilson, answering your questions. Dramatic Dove asks me, Hi, Jacqueline. Which of your characters would you like to meet in real life? And she says, P.S. I read Beaker Girls every night. Um, I'd like to meet Tracy Beaker, both when she was young and now as a grown-up mum. Uh, but I'm not sure I'd actually want to share my house with her because she's a bit full-on. Um, I think I'd love to meet Biscuits, who crops up in several of my books, who's a lovely, cheery boy and he makes excellent cakes. And if I could go back in time, I'd really like to be Petty Feather. Fact, I don't think I'd share my house with Chase Speaker either. Stick with us while we'll have Jackie Wilson answering more of your questions. It is challenge time! Yes, if you think you're a great author, the next Jacqueline Wilson, if you will, then I've got a great guest with an amazing opportunity for you. Hi everyone, it's Danny Harmer here, aka Tracy Beaker. Now, do you enjoy writing stories? Do you like coming up with new ideas, characters and settings? Do you ever think, hmm, one day I could be an author and write my own books? Then I have the perfect challenge for you. I want you to write your own short story. Now, lockdown was an unusual time for a lot of us, but what was it like for Tracy Beaker? Well, that's where you come in. In 500 words or less, I want you to tell us the story of Tracy Beaker in lockdown. What did Tracy get up to? Uh, maybe she learned a new skill, or found hidden treasure in the garden, or got a new pen pal with a major secret. Now head over to the book club page on the CBBC website and upload your story. I can't wait to read them. Danny Harbour, how good is she? What a great idea, right? What would Tracy Beaker be getting up to in the lockdown? I reckon she'd have a lot of plans. So get right in. I cannot wait to see what you guys are going to come up with. And here's some more inspiration. Here's Jacqueline Wilson herself answering more of your fantastic questions. Happy Trampolining Chocolate Waffle, wonderful name, asks, what is it like working with Nick Sharrett? And does the suggestions he make impact the way you imagine a character? Well, I've been so lucky having Nick and me working together for 30 years, I think it is now. I write the books first, then I send him the stories and he always manages to somehow or other make the character look perfect down on paper. They really are some of the most iconic illustrations in book history. Now stick with us, we'll be having a Jack and Wilson inspired book slam. Hey, have you ever wondered what Hester Feather's favourite book is? My favourite Jacqueline Wilson book is Candy Floss. I feel like a lot of people would probably expect me to say Hetty Feather, and trust me, it is definitely one of my favourites. But Candy Floss was actually one of the first Jacqueline Wilson books I ever read when I was younger, and also the first time I met Jacqueline when she came down to the set of Hetty Feather. That was the first book that she ever signed for me, so that was really exciting. I love the characters in it, the storyline is so, so good, so it's definitely one of my favourites. But I think we can all agree that all of Jackie Wilson's books are amazing. Facts, they are all amazing. Has if ever lost candy floss? Makes sense. Now, I think as we're celebrating Jacqueline Wilson on Book Club this week, we should have a Jacqueline Wilson inspired book slam debate. So, this time we're asking you, would you rather go on a sleepover in Calendar Hall with Hetty Feather and all her friends, or go on an adventure activity holiday with Tim from Cliffhanger? It's time to book slam! 
Emma. This one says, I would go on an activity adventure with Tim. I read that book at school with my year group. It was one amazing book. Go and read Cliffhanger, I love it. But wait, go go saying, I'd rather go on an adventure activity holiday with Tim and I would hope to meet Biscuits. Purple Butterfly 17 says, hello, I will definitely have a sleepover with Hetty and her friends. I love the Hetty Feather books. And Uni Horse is saying, I would rather have a sleepover in Calendar Hall with Hetty Feather and all her friends as I love Hetty Feather and sleepovers and making new friends. Oh, <laughs> stop everything. That was a great book, Sam. You, you've just done yourselves. I think, though, we cannot finish this without another video of Jacqueline Wilson answering more of your questions. Here it is. Bookworm Girl 24 says, Hi, Jacqueline. If you could be any children's book character in the world, apart from your own, who would it be? Hmm, that's an interesting question. Uh, I wonder if you've read a book called Little Women. You might have seen a film of Little Women. Um, there's a girl in that, one of four sisters called Jo, and she's a tomboy. She loves writing, she's full of fun. She gets into all sorts of scrapes, but she always actually comes out tops. I think I'd rather like to be Jo and lead her sort of life. Hadley, it's been great. Jack Wilson truly is the best. And head over to the Book Club page on the CBBC website for more fun, where you can watch Jack Wilson answering your questions there. Make sure you join us next week, where our amazing author will be Dr. Seuss.